is brought to you by South Central Regional Medical Center in Laurel. Venous insufficiency occurs when blood flow through the veins to the heart is disrupted. Dr. Jose Nasajpour says people who have careers that involve prolonged sitting or standing are at greater risk for the condition. So for example, somebody that works in a factory, somebody that works in an office all day, or even teachers are at risk for having venous insufficiency because of their occupation. Swelling or pain more at the end of the day is a common complaint of people with venous insufficiency. This is because you've spent all day on your legs, the blood has pooled in the legs, and that swelling is causing the pain. If you think you have any of these symptoms, you should be evaluated and treated. Some of the easiest treatments include the use of compression stockings. Some of the other treatments include surgical treatment. In that case, the vein is taken out of the circulation and blood flow is restored to the normal, competent veins. People who have chronic venous insufficiency over time can continue to destroy other blood vessels and ruin their circulation within their legs. When the circulation in the legs is compromised, there can be permanent skin changes, there can be non-healing wounds, Venous disease is a disease that can creep up on you over time. A lot of people think that they have to live with this swelling and pain, and that's not the case. This is an issue about quality of life that is typically covered by most insurance carriers. It's medically necessary and can be easily fixed. To schedule an appointment for a vein screening, call the South Central Vein Center at 601-649-5931. For Health Break, I'm Katherine Farah. Health Break was brought to you by South Central Regional Medical Center in Laurel.